Hey there, Geminis, and welcome now to Thursday. Well, I think partly sunny, nesting, and resting for the Geminis, especially coming off of a lunar eclipse, which is really focused on your own foundation, your family life, and how well you take care of yourself. This is the way of survival, basically. So if you have any bad habits that deal with taking good care of yourself, for instance, you don't sleep, or maybe you don't eat three times a day or whatnot, it's in the next two years that so you've got to get over that right now, Gemini. And if you're living with someone you're not happy with, or perhaps you're not in the home you've always wanted and it's been driving you crazy, you need to get on top of that in the next two years as well. This is the entire spectrum of how well you root yourself to the earth. And that's important, especially for you, Gemini, because you are a wind sign, basically. You blow all over with thought. At the end of the day, you want to retire to something that brings you back to the earth. The atmosphere may be free, but it's all kind of attached to the dirt. That's what I always say to my air signs. Now, the lunar eclipse last night really was to kind of shake the foundation of your life, literally. And it may have also kind of, in a backwards way, shaken your perception of career. We're still in Chapter 1 of Sun and Pisces. And for this entire month, Geminis will be focusing on, really, their career perspective. What's the game plan? Especially considering you want a new house or a new roommate, or you want to actually eat three times a day. What is the game plan, is the question. And I would say reserve to any conclusions for a while, at least for the next eight days. Because in this first chapter, the most common pattern of the universe is to unveil what's not working. And in many cases, why something is not working. So even though you may be down the same old road again consciously, kind of ask yourself the whys now. Get past just the realization that you don't like it. You know, Geminis can stay stuck in that detail not get to the thesis, which is more of a Sagittarian thing to do, your opposite sign. And speaking of Sagittarius, Mercury today is showing me that Geminis most likely will make some sort of fundamental belief structure decision. So you'll suddenly decide in something or believe in something that yesterday you perhaps didn't. All right, Gemini, that's all I have for Thursday. I'll see you tomorrow with your weekend forecast. Live, love, be. So garden,